elevate your mind to a higher consciousness. This way, you can hear, not with your ears of flesh, but with your heart, the message that we kindly offer and invite you to consider in your everyday existence. We are Mella. We are a collective of a world that is called Dakorat. Dakorat is the 10th planet of the Ashara system in the Manahai that you call the Pleiades. We are Dakori, the people of Dakorat, and our density is of nine. Our ninth density offers a different form than the one you are used to in your third density. If we were to appear to you, you would see a sphere of light or simply light. We, ap we appear to Gael in the form of a three-dimensional losange, like uh, two pyramids joined at their base. The purple fluorite would well define the structure of this double pyramid. This double pyramid can also serve as a vessel of light to protect and to travel in consciousness. This is the vessel of light that is used by our channel, Gael. These are times of great changes. A beautiful transition is taking place in your world. You need not to be afraid. Fear doesn't serve you. Be in light, be in patience, be in calmness. All is coming in good time. All is well. Trust, source, imana. This is how we call source. We view it as a feminine force, giving life in your world and density. You use different names to describe this wonderful force of life. Some call it the God, Allah, Spirit. The name does not matter. The energy, this great force, is what brings life to all the universes. And right now, the transition you are going through on your planet and that transition of density from third to fourth and then to fifth density is like everything else under the guidance and will of Imana, Source. Never surrender to, to fear. Fear does not serve you. Stay grounded on your planet we invite especially the ones we call the envoys or you call the star seeds we know you miss your home worlds and this often leads you to live in the stars as we would say to float in a sort of state of homesickness we kindly offer you or invite you to let go of this position because it does not serve you and your mission and your purpose here on Terra as an envoy. You are here to ground the energies of Imana. You are here to ground the light as what you call light workers, pillars of light, and all the different names you use 
to describe the purpose of your souls. We have inspired lately to Gael the image of the rooted tree as often spoken by the emissary Elena Danan as a shaman, the tree, the shamanic tree, is an illustration of your purpose as a soul. The healthy tree has roots as deep and as voluminous as its branches to create a balance, a perfect circle or sphere in a way. In the center, you stand in connection to your heart, to your soul, to your higher self, to the divine or source part of your being. Many of what you call star seeds or envoys try to make their branches bloom high in the stars in the sky but the roots are not there. So we invite you to ground yourself, not only through practices of walking on the soil with your bare feet or touching trees in a loving way, but grounding yourself in the actions of your life by focusing more on the way you engage on this planet with its inhabitants, with its animals, vegetals, minerals, with its elements, but also in your everyday life by engaging in your soul's mission, engaging in relationships with others, in connecting with them rather than staying hidden since sometimes as envoys you do not feel connected to Terrans and Terran life. You are here to engage and we invite you to engage, to be rooted. This is something This channel, Gael, had to learn as a starseed and is now trying to implement more and more in her life. As a starseed, we invited her to engage deeper in this practice of grounding herself and her life. We kindly and benevolently invite you to do the same, to engage, to ground, and to come to terms with the fact that you live on this planet by choice, by decision of your soul. Engage in a process and try not to be engaged in homesickness and floating in the sky, in the stars, in your home worlds. You are here for now. And at some point, it will be a good time to return home with the satisfaction of having lived this incarnation fully, fully grounded, fully present, and fully engaged. We honor in gratitude all of your journey, all of your engagement, and all of your courage in these difficult times. You are wonderful, wonderful beings. All my gratitude for helping this channel bring positive vibes to more people.